Welcome back to the 67th episode of a close combat last stand on and play through with the Germans in the Grand Campaign on Elite Difficulty. And I do want to apologize that the last five episodes I was kind of in a bad mood, wasn't really feeling it, I was kind of feeling like the game was putting me down a bit. But uh, you know, I had a shower, I had some food, I'm good to go, I'm feeling good now. So uh, yeah, we are now going to be fighting in uh, Nijmegen, the people that we have been fighting in Beck. And, uh, we got some Bordenstendig Einheit holding uh, the fort down here. We got reinforcements coming in. So if we can just hold on for one turn, then that's good. We have a uh, FJ Sugtrup, a regular Sugtrup. And uh, uh, four Airsatz troops. And an MG42. Against all this stuff here. Which uh, I think we can make some changes to this. Composition right there. We'll remove that and that and that. There we go. And then MG rifle team serve. I will also remove this, giving them full strength teams to work with. And uh, there we go. And give them a mortar, although I hate dealing with the mortars, but oh well. And why not give them a couple of engineer teams as well? Right, there we are. Right, they're coming in from over here. So, where do I want to get my MG? Well, it's an MG42, and that's fairly, uh, fairly accurate, so... Maybe this four-story building here will have good coverage towards the uh, enemy over there. And if we can get some other teams that have only rifles in them, also in this building. Maybe the FJ Airsatz teams. Uh, since they, uh, well, the rifles shoot far. Submachine guns do not. Something like this. There's going to be eight rifles and a, uh, and a machine gun shooting until there's going to be ten rifles. Barring people dying, of course. And uh, let's see. Maybe we put a command team here. Yeah. Uh, submachine guns are kind of holding them back a little bit, but it should really be that big of a deal. Get the airsatz team in as well, so we have some more rifles in the area. And then we have another Sug trip and uh, airsatz team. Uh, yeah, let's see. From here, do we have some reach? Very limited. Hmm, maybe from here we'll have some reach. Yeah, if you try to cross the street or anything, you'll be able to get some shots off at them. I think we just put this other Airsatz team here as well, in maybe this building. So, we should be able to hold this, I think. So let's just, oh, we could actually dig trenches as well. Uh, maybe a trench here could be good, but, yeah. Let's just do it like this. Okay, we got some enemies spotted, but we are not shooting at them. Oh, there we go. The command team, however, is not firing. Weak team. The Airsatz teams are obviously quite garbage. Okay, the mortar's going out here. Which is fine, I suppose. Maybe the MG is a bit far back. Uh, it's a fragile team, so they probably don't have a good training or, or anything, really. Gotta say, wow, we haven't actually killed a single guy yet. That's uh, a bit disturbing. But could you guys actually open fire at least? Okay, now we're getting some people hurt, sounds like. The enemy mortals aren't really hitting home, so that's good. 
Let's see, these guys can reach over to this building here somewhat with their uh, SMGs. I guess I'll just keep them on the fence. I mean, they're spreading out, they're taking a lot of positions, but as long as we can just hold out, though, it's all good. In fact, it doesn't really even matter if we lose, because we'll come in with mechanized units. Although, mechanized units here, if the enemy has bazookas, might not be very good. We're taking a few casualties, to say the least. Why are you shooting at stuff that's like not running directly towards you in the middle of the street, but hiding in buildings? Come on, guys. What is happening here? Why are these enemies not getting blasted to fucking smithereens? It's really ridiculous these guys manage to push this far and not get shot to pieces. These teams are really, really are not the best I've ever seen. Uh, well, now we're starting to inflict some casualties at least. Holy shit, they're not hitting anything. Like, we haven't killed a single guy. They were on the street there. Just on the street, and we're not killing them. What the hell? This is actually ridiculous. Well, at least that MG infantry is dealt with. There's so many dudes just out in the open street, and they're not being punished for it. It's, in fact, ridiculous. When I played here with the allies attacking her, if I had anything just out in the street, it would be annihilated instantly. So, WTF is actually going on here. Now, I think we're gonna fall back a little bit. This seems like a bad position to try to hold. Let's just get some smoke grenades out, and then we just sneak off. I hope this works without us taking any more casualties. We can just kind of cross the street here. Oh, more coming in. Use your submachine guns, boys. Use them. Come on, oh no, the phone grenades at us. Someone died, probably over here. Actually, I don't know. Could be her, yeah, it was her. It's the MG team. We've got 102 MG rounds left, but they're panicking, so I'm not sure we're going to actually be able to fire them off. Right, either way, we're going to do a retreat here. We're going to fall back with these guys and try to link them up with the, uh, the rest of the team, so we'll hear if we can. If we can, or maybe we get them on the corner here, actually. Just right there, set up, and uh, get ready. Ammo is uh, definitely a concern at this point. There's no denying that. Um, yeah. Okay, that's not good. We're taking massive fire over here. Let's just keep moving. Just get safe if we can. Well, at least the enemy is missing a lot as well. It's not just my guys. Be a tough one, this. Okay, I lost another guy in the command team. And if we can do it like this, uh, no. head over that way. Same for these guys, just head over this way. Hopefully, not get pummeled on the way there. These guys back on the fund. Hmm. Yeah, that's a bit tricky here. 
And hopefully we'll be able to hold. Machine guns out of ammo. We still have a bunch of rifles firing at least, so that's good. I mean, all we need to do is hold this for one turn now, huh? and then we have reinforcements coming in next time. So, if we just keep our guys in it to win it, then uh, well, we might actually win it. Alright, you know what? We're gonna move these guys in here instead. That might be better. Get them on the corner here, start shooting these guys in the street or something. people missing bullets on both sides like the generally yeah <laughs> oh okay you know what I'm actually gonna do I'm gonna have the uh, MG team here kind of call away if I can there's two guys still alive in it so we'll, we'll still have it next time around which is gonna be useful so I can get these guys in corner to maybe support over here this is a three-story building, so I'm hoping they can reach over these two-story buildings to shoot into this. Fuck, this guy is uh, And he's running straight towards the enemy, so he's gonna die. Okay, well, we don't have the MG42 uh, team next time around, then. And they do have some reach over here, so that's good. Anything I can do to make it harder for the enemy. What an idiot. I'm gonna ask for a truce, and we're obviously not getting that. I could ask. But at least finally the enemy morale is starting to go down there. The MG42 team. Such is life, I guess. And there goes that command team. Force morale is getting low, but as long as we can just hold. Also, we really don't actually need to hold, because we'll attack her next time around. But if we hold, then these guys won't be moving on, I believe, at least, so... And then we'll be fighting them here on this map once more. Although, we are taking quite a few casualties. I'm just gonna have that two off already. Anytime the enemy might want to go for that, that's the time I'm down to go for that. Certainly struggling here, huh? that's for sure. These guys are starting to run out of ammo. You can probably scavenge these guys a little bit since they have run out of ammo. I believe there's two mouses just lying here. Huh? And another dead guy here with a mouse unless he's been scavenged already. These guys are low on ammo as well. Remove the truce off of. Let's see what comes of that. Did I just see someone here now? Yeah, they're here. They're taking the 2 9 Megan Bridge, like the location. Hmm. Did we lose another guy? I think we did. Okay, I'm actually gonna just have that truce off for that though. Uh, yeah. This is not ideal. I 
There should be so many dead bodies in this area, but didn't kill a single one. It's quite ridiculous. Yeah, ammo is definitely an issue here. Oh, a miracle that we're still holding this, actually. Okay, some of our leads, nice good. There really isn't much I can do, I just need to hold these positions and hope for the best, pretty much. It's, uh, that's my best bet here, I would say. Well, hello. I'm about to get some company. Maybe I should have held up more people up in this corner here, but then again they would be able to push through the rest of the map very much quicker, so... I don't know. Tricky, uh, tricky situation to be in. I honestly thought we'd be able to do a bit better, uh, considering the amount of uh, soldiers we have here. But yeah, I mean, ammo is definitely something we do not have a lot of right now. This guy has one guy here with 13 bullets left. That's about it. Over here. Well, over here are some ammo. I mean, it can just scavenge the few dead guys over here as well, which I suppose helps. Good. Enemy morale going down even further. We need to push it even further, though, before um, there's a chance of a truce. Alternatively, we can hold out for the duration of the battle. Which is definitely a possibility. We're on like 70% of the time already spent, so. Yeah. Uh, yep. <laughs> this could have gone better, I feel. Oh, there we go. Ceasefire. Beautiful. Uh, stalemate. Yeah, I mean, let's look at the details. So, so we killed six guys, incapacitated ten. So 16 total. I mean, we lost six. Incapacitated 8, so that's 14. Well, we did a little bit more damage to the Americans than they did to us, but considering we're defending, I was hoping we'd be doing quite a bit more than this. I want to see the MG team did not really do that much. Uh, but oh well, I hope you enjoyed the episode. And if you did, well, I would appreciate if you would consider leaving a like on it, and maybe even subscribing if you haven't already. That being said, you can catch me in the next one, and uh, well, let's see how that goes. Have a good one.